Before we get started with using expanded form to support addition and subtraction, we will first review expanded form. Expanded form is a number sentence where numbers are broken to hundreds, tens, and ones to represent each of the place values. So our first number we're looking at is 82. If we are breaking 82 into expanded form, the 8 has a value of 80. The 2 has a value of 2. 80 plus 2 equals 82. Next problem. Next number, 99. The 9 in the tens place has a value of 90. The 9 in the ones place has a value of 9. 90 plus 9 equals 99. Our last number, 37. The tens place has a value of 30. The 7 in the 1's place has a value of 7. 30 plus 7 equals 37. You are comfortable with taking numbers and breaking them into their expanded form. You are ready to use expanded form as a strategy. Let's start with 52 plus 22. Our first step will be to see that the value of the 5 in the tens place is 50. The value of the 2 in the ones place is 2. Looking at 22, the value of the 2 in the tens place, I think I want the tens place to be red. The 2 in the tens place has a value of 20. The 2 in the ones place has a value of 2. Now, we will add the values in the ones place and the values in the tens place. 2 plus 2 equals 4. Fifty plus 20, 50. 60, 70 has a value of 70. Our answer will be 70 plus 4, which is 74. Our next addition problem has 76 plus 21. While I'm writing, I want you to tell me what steps happen next.
were you able to talk me through expanding 76 into 70 plus 6 and 21 into 20 plus 1? Great! Now, let's add the 1's place. Does your expanded form show that 90 plus 7 will give us our answer? Let's now look closely at using expanded form to subtract. We have 57 minus 22. Using expanded form, we will look at our tens and our ones. Separate 57 into expanded form. Now, we have our expanded form, but instead of adding these numbers, we have to be sure that we are attending to that this is a subtraction problem. So, 7, take away, or minus 2, gives us 5. 50, Minus 20 would give us 30 plus 5 will be the difference for this problem. So 57 minus 22 equals 35. Moving on to 57 minus 23. We need to build the expanded form of 57 and 23. Once you've built your expanded form, it's important for us to remember that we are subtracting. So 7 minus or take away 3 equals 4, 50 minus or take away 20 the difference of our problem is equal to 30 plus 4 
Now, I have shown you a new strategy for adding and subtracting using expanded form. I encourage you to practice this skill with a few of your problems and see if it is a good fit for you.